Tick, tick, tock, it's beer o'clock, so what have you got to lose? Tick, tick, tock, it's beer o'clock, with Slosh and Buzz. Oh, yeah. All right. Hi, this is Slosh. Buzz. Welcome back to Beer O'Clock with Slosh and Buzz for week two of our January 2020 run. You know, I've been, I've been having, like, dreams about this run for months, you know? Been having 2020 vision. Really? Yep. I've been wanting to do that joke all year. Cyberpunk 2020, officially this year. Cyberpunk 1987. I was just about to crap this drink. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, as always, so yeah, we had theme. a heads crunch by the wagon last week. So yeah, we'll just try to get back in the swing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, basically, Ooh, we were the Hulk jumping out of the thing in Ragnarok. We were, no, yeah. and now we're waking up to some yeah. bearded. Iris. Um, but yes, it's week two. There's a theme running through it. Win the sauce that's named after me. Which tastes absolutely bloody fantastic. Not spicy, but it's really delicious. Um, and uh, Buzz is going to read this one. Yeah. So yeah, there you go. So today I have a... We have an inclusion to the theme of some random beer that I picked up and I thought a oh, home style IPA. See what that's about. Elegant little logo on the front there. The gold and all that sort of stuff. And then I started looking into it a bit more. I was like, oh, thoughtfully brewed. So you just, you just you just bought this at the liquor shed. Yeah, as, on a whim. I thought I, I, want, I want a nice beer. And then you looked IPA. into it. You didn't look into it. No, first. I didn't. No, no. Because it's fairly nondescript, man. Yeah, the can. The, I pulled the can off the shelf. I saw. Hey, that's um, the thing that was on the car in in the pictures. That's right. Yeah, right. Okay. And I yeah, saw yeah, the yeah. Uh, cultivate variety. I saw home style IPA, and I saw soft, juicy mosaic on the side of the can there, and I thought, yep, I'm in. And then I looked over and I was like, thoughtfully brewed and canned in Nashville, Tennessee by Bearded Iris Brewing. And this is a pint of uh, 16th flip, Oz, uh, of 6% alcohol, uh, haze bomb, Home style cultivate variety IPA, and when I poured it into oh, so the glass, you've already tried this one. Uh, yeah, and when I poured it into the glass and saw that, folks, saw that lovely haze with that awesome soft carbonation. Now I thought I'm in for a treat here. Um, Buzz actually, when we were walking around working out the thing, this is the first beer that we saw, and Cam said, Buzz said, we have to try that. You have to try this one. It's fun, great. So this, 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 the theme is somewhat bent around this one. Yeah, a bit. Now, this uh, beer in Nashville, right? It cost us uh, thirteen bucks from Liquor Shed. Um, yeah, because we got we got the discount promotion on the shelf. Promotion yeah, on the had, shelf. Uh, yeah. What was it? Thirty percent off on the shelf. It was a good deal. Um, so it's six percent. It's got uh, mosaic hops in it, and it's by this little place called Bearded Iris in Nashville. Now, if you Google Bearded Iris. And have a little street walk tour around the uh, brewery, and have a look at the photos of the inside of the place. This is literally. I think I'll put the pictures up. Hang on. <laughs> yeah, do there, it. There might be enough yeah, space. Do it there. Just keep talking. You only got under control. Yeah, I've got under control. Flies. It's out of control, folks. <laughs> um, but it actually looks incredible in there. It's an old style bar, which reminds me, it's it's something you could just cut the photo out and paste it into Red Dead Redemption and it would not look out of place at all. I started drinking. I know. <laughs> it got me. Um, it actually reminded me from the photos that I just saw of a country pub that, uh, that I... Uh, I'm to show you. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, tell them what it looks like, man. It looks like salmon gums. Salmon gums, he reckons. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, man. It trivialised the whole show. Can you just continue <laughs> on with your awesome story? Um, I'll, I'll do this next time. But yeah, <laughs> check it out. Bearded Iris. I had another one from them called Tunnel Vision. It was another haze bomb. They look like they're very uh, authentic in their craft and there's no preservatives or anything like that. And I just, I just found it amazing that this little backwater little pub that looks like something that's out, out of the uh, early in 19th like a, century. Um, industrial we, area. Yeah. It looks like something, you know, it's, it's, just, it does. it's around like other... Just like mechanics and yeah, and next to the like, Cumberland River there. Yeah, oh, and I I just that's think that's like a sausage. It's amazing that we can get the beers little from little it. sausage river. Yeah, cheers, now, cheers, folks. Now let's both try. I, this beer well, you've already tried it, you bastard. Time. Don't ruin the magic. 
<laughs> it's really easy drinking. Now everything... It's got a nice aftertaste. That's mosaic, hey. Mm. I'm sure of it. Because I put it on the can. <laughs> <laughs> You've done your research this time. I have. Yeah, I looked at the can. I am um, now neither I'm of really us feeling the previous week's beer now. Yeah. So anyway, <laughs> last week's Ooh, beer was ten percent, and and this one is we both uh, had a one soft, pant on a soft. Six. We may no longer have yeah. one pant on. There's one pant. It was two pants. Last one time. pant. Now two. there's one it was, leg. It was two pants last time. Two pants, so four legs. Now it's uh, one pant with two legs. So next it's going to be no pants. It's going to be a skirt. With one leg. It's going to be a, it's going to zinger. It's going to be a. <laughs> A skilt. A skilt. <laughs> it's a it's a skirt kilt. Skirt kilt. Skilt. Is that what the punk girls wear? A skilt? Look. Or do they just wear a kilt or a skirt? What is it, Cam? A skort. No, they're skorts. Skorts is skirt shorts. A scrap. What's that? A skirt hat. A skirt that you shit yourself in. <laughs> I don't know. It's a it's a skirt shat. Yeah, it's scrap. <laughs> Anyway, look, um, it's, <laughs> it's a used skirt. I'm sorry, folks. I, I just said I was feeling last week's beer. So that was just, you can't that blame just me. spiraled within seconds. Yeah. Oh, I'm really feeling last week's beer. I've drink. done all my research. I looked at the can. Anyway. A skirt that you shut yourself in is a scrap. So, what I'm going to say is the can itself is fairly nondescript, but. You're not going to go help with shopping this time. We're way too far into it. No, I can't do it. Yeah, no, she can, she can carry it this time. We always cut and start again. Um, She's not doing so, a weekly show. So, so the bearded iris can. Love you, honey. Shout outs to honey. Love you, hon. <laughs> it looks to me like a skunk or a raccoon. And the raccoon makes me think of Davy Crockett. And that makes me think of Nashville for some reason, even though I have no context on that. I'm going to give a 10 out of 10 in the can for Davy Crockett, skunk face. It's very understated. It's very understated, but they don't but need... it's chock full of flavour. It's exactly what it says. Uh, in it the is. glass... It's soft, it's juicy, it's mosaic. It's, in the glass, it's... this mosaic, soft, juicy thing in my hand, I'm going to give it 8. Haze bomb. And on taste, th I, I'm, I'm hesitantly... Because I gave the last one nine at the beginning before it started getting really boozy. I'm hesitantly leaning towards this being higher than that, but I can't go to ten. I can't retroactively change a rating, can I? Yourself for the, I'll fuck for the myself. Yeah. I'm going to give this one 9.05. Nine. Just giving it nine. Give me this one nine. So what did I say? Something. Something. Nine? Yeah, good. This is better than the other one. This is better than the other one. This is much more of a... Oh, I could retcon it. It's definitely a neeper. Oh, I could retcon it. All right. Yeah, retcon No, no, wait. Yeah. All right. This beer is better than the last one. You're changing the score from this one to seven. Yeah? Yeah. All right, so we're back, and uh, that'll be in the last one. Cool. Uh, so this is nine. 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 Yeah. yeah, fuck, I forgot we could do that. Yeah. I put these videos out. They're not out until I've done them. This isn't live. Fucking live. We yeah. should do a live one. Get back into it. What? Oh, I... But I, I'm really impressed with this beer. When I cracked it open, I was like, yep, yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. Uh, surprised that it was a haze bomb, but it's very, very hazy. It's very juicy. Um, single hot mosaic at 6%. It, uh, I reckon it probably could go 7% just to get the booze taste in there a bit more, get it all... Or is that just because you had the 10% one before? And that it could be because of the 10% one before. Mm. Yeah. But no, I will give this, like, presentation... I mean, we do have a break in between, so... It, it, it made me be. buy it. I was like, yep, that's understated and classy. I want to have a look at it. And then when I looked at their brewery, I was like, wow, understated and classy. And, um... The chandelier looks awesome. Yeah. I will give it a... 8 in the can... In the glass, I will give that a Day 10 baby. because that's exactly Day what I want to see. Hey. Okay. Straw coloured haze. <coughs> nice carbonation. Have burps have been on point today. <laughs> <laughs> Enough to uh, keep your head through Ooh. throughout the drinking. And yeah, I'll fucking give it a 10 in the glass, like I said. And on flavour, it's pretty delicious, man. 
Can't fault the juice. And what I like is it, it doesn't have too much of a sweetness at the end of it. Like the, it still gives you like a firm bitterness to mm. to what it does keep you wanting more like on a hot day. So I give it give it nine point five. This is a this is a this is you're right, this is an excellent it's beer. Good beer, eh? From this weird little place in Tennessee. On the discount yeah. shelf at the, at the liquor shed after Christmas, yeah. in that bit where they're trying to clear stock. That's right. Um, it's fantastic. I, I, I'm actually quite blown away by it. Yeah, I reckon. It says thoughtfully brewed and canned. Yeah, and you can tell it's brewed with love and top care in the craft. Especially get it over here yeah. in this kind of condition. Is, is Oh, yeah, with all the people who leave fucking... Masterful. Like, Pallets in the, the sun over here, especially considering we've been in a fucking heat wave. Yeah. Yeah. She'll be right, mate. She'll be right, mate. It's just a beer. Anyway, <laughs> uh, I don't think there's anything else we need to say about that. We said the price. Mm -hmm. We actually did pay $9.09 for this, but that was with... with um, the 30% off. 30% off. So it was $3.90 discount. Purely because it was on the shelf, not because it's out of code or anything like no, that. Just no. props as to the liquor shed for passing well. on great deals. That's right. To dickheads like us. Shout outs and to you. Hoff. Hoff. Shout outs to Nate. Shout outs to Lauren. Does uh, what's her face to work there? Tish. Tish. Uh, she may be going back. There. Shout outs to Tish anyway. Shout out. Congratulations, Tish. Your yeah, baby's yeah. so cute. You'd be a wonderful mum. Is she? Will she? We're being very uh, sedate. Sedate way. and serious. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Props to Tish. We had to rein it back in after the scars. <laughs> we did. We did. <laughs> we, we, like, did right. we did it automatically without yeah. thinking. Yeah. So anyway, guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. And this is the most fun thing that we do. Um, um, we missed it so much. My psychiatrist said she was glad I was doing this again because I needed this because I need this dickhead. And I, I love this him. dude. I love him. Because this is our therapy and friendship. <laughs> this is our this isn't about you guys. <laughs> This is about us. So cheers to you guys. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so cheers to you folks. We love you guys. Uh, we wouldn't be here without you. And um, we'll see you guys next week. There's a theme going through this. It is easier than last week. Unless... We would be here. We would be here. We'd still do it. We'd still do it. Hey. <laughs> we'll talk off camera. Uh, we'll see you guys Fire next week. The for week three of the My January 2020 run. Season five. Donkey. Oh, wait. We can bring Place. it... We we can bring in the, 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 the new phrase. It's always beer o'clock somewhere. It's always beer o'clock somewhere. This is going to mean something very, very soon. And stuff. Please. Oh, Christ. <laughs>